if we go the black man if the black man is going to pay into something he should pay into himself you should he, if if you go out and work for the white man and he got to take all this money out and the money you got left over from him taking the out you got to give to pay you pay the cost of living then the money you got left over from that you got to give to the preacher and what's left for you and your family you got to give to the schools so they can operate you can graduate so if we gonna do all this why give it to our oppressor? Our oppressor. You say, well, he ain't our oppressor. Well, look around. If Christopher Columbus came over here and now that you don't see the, too many Indians just walking around like you, you used to, if you see the black men all up in the jailhouse, if you see them warring, having wars all over the planet, the military, I'm going to tell you something else, too. Uh, the uh, National Rifle Association, they're not gonna give up their guns. It's gonna be a war before they give up their guns. You know? Uh, because they feel like the army, you know, they call themselves patriots, you know? They feel like the army should give up theirs. The police should give up theirs. Well, it looked like, uh, don't nobody have no guns. Then you're gonna have to bow down to them. You're bowing down to the police anyway. The black man is. He, but the white man, he ain't gonna bow down to that police. You know, because he believes in that constitution. And he gonna, before he give up his guns, he ain't he he gonna fight. The United States state system is weak. But you got to recognize, black man, that the system is weak. And it's going to cave in on itself. But you don't want it to cave in on you. You want to rise above this system. So you're going to have, you're going to have to separate. Do your own thing, man. Now, if, if we got to fight a revolution like they fought Britain, they still lost. They still under control of Europe. So we don't want to fight it like they did. We're going to have to use our scientific minds to defeat them with. See, science and God are uh, on the same. God is a scientist. Science means to know. That's the word science. That's what it means. So we're gonna have we're gonna have to have a 70 degrees of separation from this white man before we be out of harm's way. 70 degrees of separate separation from this from this guy and his system. But it's got to be a righteous system. It can't be a system like how he work his thing. No. It's got to be a righteous system or it ain't going to work. Black light. I hope y'all get this. <laughs>